It's time to come out of the closet. <laughs> hey, I'm trying to find out there's something going wrong with this light switch. All right. There's an intermittent short somewhere. It's either in the light switch or in the adjoining plugs next to the bed. This switch controls two lights beside the bed, one on each side of the bed. Every time you turn on the lights, or not every time, but every once in a while, you turn those on or you turn this switch on or the adjoining ceiling fan switch, it trips the breaker. Now I'm not quite sure exactly what's going on. There could be a loose wire nut in here, the switch could be bad, the plugs next to the bed could be bad. Something is going on and I'm getting tired of it. Here's that switch again. I want to show you the lights. Here's the light next to the bed there and here's one right here. Now those plugs behind there, there could be something going on back there too so I might as well check that out as well. Something else might be going on too. Here's an electrical sub-panel and it could be a bad breaker too. Now, I don't know of any good way to check breakers. Usually a breaker does not go out and I've always been taught to try to find everything on the circuit first. Check all that stuff out first and then worst case scenario change your breaker. Now I don't want to go to the store and pay $35, $40 for a breaker and find out it's a $2 light switch or something like that or a loose wire nut. That's why you always start from the beginning. Here's something else to consider. Could it be possible that this fan switch is bad causing the tripping fiasco? Well, it could be, but because I saw that the ground wire was not hooked up I've done that first. I didn't want to have to replace this unless we still have things going on. This, this light switch here for the fan, it's actually a fan switch. Off, high, medium, low. And um, that itself is probably over $30. I'm not going to just go ahead and replace that on a whim. You know what I mean? I mean, I've got the, I've got the power back on. I've, I've checked it out. Everything seems to be working okay. And we're going to see what happens. That's all I have for now, but I'll be back with more videos.